Welcome to Cheeseology with Adam, the cheesiest channel on YouTube. I'm Adam. Today I'm going to be taking you through how to use a Dutch style cheese press. This is my preferred style of press that I like to use. Real easy and I get great results with it. So just to get you familiar with the cheese press, here we have a drain pan. This is where your cheese form would set depending on what kind of cheese you're making, how big. Um, you, have the, you have a lever here. Basically you have the fulcrum, you have the load point, and then you have a lever. All you're doing is hanging weights depending on how much weight you need on this lever. It presses down on the cheese within the form and that's basically it. A couple things to know here which, which is why I really like this form. Instead of needing to gather 40 pounds of weight if you need to press at 40 pounds or 60 or 100 or even 150 pounds, this this press is actually rated for only 100. But even if I had to press at 100 pounds, I don't need an actual 100 pounds of weight because it works like a lever. So if you remember from, from middle school or high school, the way, the way a lever works, the point from the fulcrum to the load, which is the point at where we're pressing, you take that same distance, which would be about right here. So if I were to hang five pounds of weight right here, which I can't because it's in the way, it would be five pounds of pressure. But if I double that distance, go now, now I'm taking two times this distance here. If I have a five pound jug of water and I just hang it right here, this actually becomes 10 pounds. So you, you increment up the weight of what you're actually hanging for each distance that you are from the fulcrum to the load point. If I go out another same distance, here, so this is right now this point here is three times the distance of the fulcrum to the load point. My five pound jug just became 15 pounds. So when I'm pressing harder cheeses that need a lot of weight, I can fill this to about eight pounds. And what I do is I just take some wire, some heavy duty wire, and I have a couple other jugs that I just wire together and then I hang them from here. So eight times three is 24 three times the length here of the fulcrum to the to the load point I can actually load hang what would what is equivalent to about 75 pounds pressing down on this cheese which is great some of the other cheese presses use a spring springs on like little poles and you, you tighten down the nuts until you get to whatever weight you want 10 or 15 pounds but as that compresses the cheese you'll see that bottom there's a, the bottom part that's actually pressing on the cheese expands out so you're not truly keeping that weight so you would have to keep on adjusting those this you just calculate what you need at what distance and hang it and forget it um, again super easy to use i love this thing it's definitely my preferred style of cheese press and i've always gotten excellent results thanks for watching if you have any questions please don't hesitate to put it in the comments and I'll be more than happy to, to answer. Um, also, please like and subscribe. Really appreciate that. Thank you very much.